Hey guys, what's up? This is DRH or Daniel, whatever the fuck you want to call me. Don't really care. Um, got another game of searches. Uh, searching for wow, I'm still in that gay little Call of Duty mode going on. The fucking shit's like addicting. But now I have Reach and Modern Warfare 2 can suck my big fat black cock on a white man's body. That is right. Um. Basically, got another commentary for you guys, like I said, and basically, I think I do pretty well here. I go, I don't, I don't think KD matters on this game at all, but I still like to, I don't, I mean, of course, like in a game, you don't really want to die, but there's no reason to camp, because it's basically, besides Slayer, all objective, and this is Slayer, and even then, this, th you can compare this on Modern Warfare 2 to, uh, to, I guess, Mercenary Team Deathmatch, or just Team Deathmatch, because you can play with friends. And as you can see, no one's really camping. Everyone's running around, and there's lots of lots of action constantly, which is what I'm really enjoying about this game. The only thing I'm not really enjoying is, I mean, it should get better, and I mean, it's nothing even close to as any complaints I could have with Modern Warfare 2. Not even the smallest complaint about Modern Warfare 2. Modern Warfare 2, like the smallest complaint I have with that, is probably ten times worse than the the one complaint I have about this and that's two of the loadouts which is the um oh, I can't even think of what it's called um the the invisibility and the other one which is where you like fucking punch the ground and you are invincible for b about eight seconds or so <laughs> and those uh people seem to be whoring them just because they're they're new I mean invisibility you had in Halo 3 which I mean it it wasn't a constant thing like that you had to go find it on the map but either way, it's I mean it's fine. It's not that bad. I have nothing to really complain about about this game. It's still amazing. But uh, one thing I really am liking about this game is when it comes to making videos, they they saturated things already in the game when you're actually playing. The colors are so vibrant that you really don't need any color correction. So that saves about you know a few minutes off of my time. Not very much, but I'm lazy as shit. So you know, I mean any bit of time counts. But either way, <laughs> I basically just wanted to show you this because it is my first Reach gameplay for you guys. And it's just in case any of you don't have ODST, because I know some of my friends and maybe some of my subscribers don't have ODST. And you haven't really seen any videos, this will this is just a uh, kind of an... Inf uh, how do I say this word? So bad at thinking of big words when I when it comes to it um, an informational video I guess I could just say it that way when um, so just it just it's just gonna give you some some insight on how this game works and how how it is and if you like it you can check it out and hopefully this will let you know whether you like it or not before you maybe potentially waste money on this game when it comes out in September in case you didn't know but I really don't think that anyone could really waste their money on this game. I mean, if you, if for some reason you don't like this game, you're, you're fucking retarded. You're just, you've got Down syndrome, and you're a midget. You're both, and you're like the most retarded Down syndrome kid in the world. All right, enough uh, insults and stuff. But <clears throat> so hopefully this this commentary will show you what the game's like, what you like about it. And I want to, I want to, I want to see some comments from people letting me know what you like the most about this game. If you have played it, or if you haven't played it yet, what looks the most fun to you, or if you plan on getting it or not. And I know some people are on my friends list aren't planning on getting it because of the fact that I don't know they just they're they're Call of Duty players for life, I guess you could say. And so basically, they really don't want to play anything like Halo just because of how different it is. And I guess, like, I, a kind of mindset I had, too, was I went back to Call of Duty after the first day of Reach just because I missed Call of Duty. And then about five minutes into it, I realized how much I hate Call of Duty. And now I'm back on this permanently, which has got to be the best decision I've made. And, I mean, I did I did, uh, I did promise some friends I would uh, keep making Call of Duty videos. But it would not be Modern Warfare 2. It'll only be... I have a... Well, let me just say. I have some... 
Modern Warfare 2 commentaries, and a few of them will be commentated by one of my friends, Infested Legacy. Shout out to you, uh, thanks for commentating some of them for me, because I had like fucking ten of them. So, I guess if any of you are interested in Modern Warfare 2, you could look forward to those. Um, they're all search and destroy, except for one of them, I believe, and that one is a... It is, it's a, um, what is it? It's a domination on Scrapyard, and I go like 52 and 20. And um, the only reason I posted that because the score isn't too great is because I thought the score was extremely good for the, the, um, what do you say, the, uh, the amount of objectives I was playing. Because I played the objectives like crazy on that one. I, uh, I constantly was capping flags, or at least in my opinion, compared to what I normally do, I was constantly capping flags. So I thought that was a pretty good game. But enough about Modern Warfare 2. Um, I will put out some maybe some COD vids. They probably won't all be commentaries. And maybe none of them be commentaries. I'm not really sure how it'll work. But most of them will just be short clips. And maybe something cool I get. Or something funny that happens. You know just short. Maybe up to a minute at the most clip. And you can look forward to that. And more Reach gameplays. Maybe some Halo 3. If for some reason. Because I've been hearing rumors going around that. This beta isn't going to last until Modern, not Modern God damn it, I keep saying Call of Duty things now. But it people have been saying that this game isn't going to last until the actual game's release. So that the beta will only be here for like a month or so. But I'm not so sure about that. So we'll see what happens. Uh, hope you guys enjoyed this. Uh, peace out. Um, subscribe and everything. Never leave those comments. See ya.